2008 Dot Charger with the Hemi in it, 5.7. Customer complaint is car runs really rough. Got multiple misfires. Went to multiple shop. They replace, according to him, they replace coils, injectors, plugs, and lifters. So all these four things were replaced, and car still behaving the same way. It's got multiple misfire. The codes were showing. The codes were. I'll show you guys. I'm trying to pull the codes up. These are the codes that are coming up. Reactivation control performance on 764. 7 is in bank 1. 6 and 4 is in bank 2. So I was able to uh, plug my pressure transducer in. And I got the waveform. And I'll show you the difference between valves that is not opening versus valves valves that are supposed to be opening and closing what the form looks like the beauty of pressure transducer is it tells you what is going on in cylinder mechanical gauge would not tell you mechanical gauge will just tell you yeah it's got a good compression so i'll show you two different captures and uh we'll show you the activities what's going on so here comes a picture one as you can see this is the cylinder number let's see it was cylinder number four that i put my pressure transducer in and look nothing is happening no valves none of that is opening and closing so i'll show you the good known the good known capture was captured from uh, cylinder number two on bank two so this is cylinder number two on bank two look at that you see the difference valves exhaust valve opens then it closes intake closes then it gets compression and the uh, the whole thing repeats itself so that's the beauty of electronic pressure transducers telling you what's going on mechanically so i'm not sure if the lifter was replaced or not that's very um to me it's very iffy so we'll talk to customers see what they want to do but 100 percent that car needs an either lifter or an engine Car does have 199,000 miles on it, so.